Hello everyone, welcome back to the final day of the week, Friday. Today we are checking out the Polito Bay impound lot, which adds an impound lot to Polito Bay. Obviously there wasn't one there before, and it kind of makes a little bit more use of that empty land all around Polito with the empty lots and all of this. Um, we looked at a police station refit last episode, so if you haven't seen that, go check that out. Um, but this time we are looking at the impound lot. So all you have to do to install this is go to the resource page linked in the top of the description and go ahead and click the download link, which will take you to a Google Drive, um, another Google Drive external link. And then you're in, a, in the top right hand corner, press the download button. It'll download as a RAR file and open this up with WinRAR, WinZip, 7-Zip, whatever you use to open up these files. That's what you're going to open them up with. Make sure to subscribe, by the way. Anyway, now that you have this downloaded, this is a server side script. So what you're going to have to do is you're going to have to go to wherever your server is located. For me, it's my server data resources folder is where all my resources and my server are located. For you, it's probably either zap hosting or your TX data folder. If you're using one of the newer methods to create your server inside of your resources folder, all you have to do is drag in this whole folder. There is no internal folder other than the stream. So we know we're not going to have any loading issues. Um, a few people have asked about that. If you have two folders inside themselves without, um, with like separate naming and stuff, make sure you're, and it's not loading, make sure your second folder has all of the actual files in it and use that one instead. Um, so we're just going to rename this and just copy the name. I'm not actually going to rename the folder. I just copy the name to keep it easy. Then I'm going to go to server data, server.cfg, edit it with notepad plus plus, and then add ensure the name of that resource to the bottom of our starting resources list. And now we're going to go ahead and start the server. And when we start the server, just check console to make sure you see started resource, Polito Bay inbound. You know we are good to go. So let's hop in game and check it out. All right, so we are in game here, and you can see there is a nice little inbound lot here. And people still hang around here, obviously, because the NPCs are designed to spawn here. You have the little individual chain link in between, and then you have the big uh, chain. And obviously, this gate does work as well. So feel free to use this in your 5M server. I think it's pretty cool. If you are new here, make sure to subscribe. But that is it for this week. I will see you on Monday morning. Enjoy the shorts for this weekend. Anyway, thanks so much for watching. Enjoy the rest of your weekend, and I will see you next time. Bye, everyone.